Hello, hello. Right when you go live, I never know if people see you or not. Can anyone see me? I don't know. Hi, hi. What's up, Jake? Okay, cool. I see you guys. How's it going? Josh Swickard here. Um, Lauren's making um, herself a plate of dinner. Um, it's so late. Sorry, yeah, sorry if it's late. Um, how's everyone doing? This is fun. Um, if you don't know me, my name's Josh. <laughs> I'm married to Lauren in the fridge. Um, and um, we said, I don't know, what was it, like a month ago or so? Uh -huh. And we were like, oh, we're gonna do this every week. We, we love connecting with our fans, all this stuff. And it just didn't happen. And life got crazy busy. And, and so <laughs> we're, um, we're gonna be better. But um, just want to check in with you and uh, see how you all are doing. Okay, I can go live with fans, but I, I'm scared because I went live with a fan once, Lauren and I did, and- She was awesome. She was so you cool, so but I think I scared her. Like, I think you I surprised her and she didn't know that I could see her for a second and it was like startling for both of us. So. <laughs> Um, so I have like a little bit of PTSD that I don't know what I'm going to get. We were getting but... used to the live. Right on. Here's Thank the Lauren. Thank you. I the have pregnant, wet. The I pregnant have, lady. I have ah. wet hair. <laughs> she just took we're a shower. We're very excited. We're having a baby. Um, we haven't, I haven't talked about it. She's talked about it a little bit. I haven't talked about it. I'm going to be a dad. And I'm so excited. He's gonna be a girl dad. I'm gonna be a girl dad. And so cute. Yeah. I, words cannot express how excited I am. And um, um we just finished the baby room. What? <gasps> like yesterday. Like yesterday. Well, it's not all the way done. We have cute wallpaper up. We have our crib and our chair and changing table. It looks good. It's cute. Josh built the changing table himself. I built the chain, and I'm, hold on. This is impressive if you know me, because I don't do this stuff. I <laughs> built the changing table and the crib, and I kind of puttied a wall. You did putty a wall. And I sanded it. That was hot. He puttied it was, a wall. <laughs> it was super impressive to me, because if it's not Ikea, I can't do it. It's just, it is what Ikea's it is. Ikea's hard, though fan from the Philippines. What's up, man? I've always wanted to go to the Philippines. Same. The beaches. Um, Can we see the baby room? We're going to show it actually on... I, th mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I think some... I think we're going to have a little surprise feature with the baby room soon. It's not a big but, deal, but we are going to do it. I think it's going to be on uh, a, a, a program yeah. asked to, to show it. And so we are like, oh, okay. Yeah. We're excited. What's up, Pennsylvania? So, oh, there are questions. Okay, this makes me so excited when you guys ask questions. Did Lauren change the spelling of her name when she took your last? Wait, oh, this, this is, is a, a funny, funny story. So, <laughs> I was gonna say that. My, it's my, a baby girl. Sorry, keep going. And we're having a baby girl. Um, my name is classically spelled L A U R E N, like it is now. But when I first started my acting career, there was another model named Lauren York. York was it's my probably old... Probably a very sweet person. We just don't Yeah, know. York was my old last name. And people would confuse us all the time because we looked enough alike, I guess, online. I don't know. So I had to change the spelling of my name to L-O-R-Y-N-N -N for acting stuff. And then when and I now got... she changed it back. And then when I got married to Josh, I could change my name back. Yep. So that's the story. There were other questions and I missed them. Um, but uh, but yeah, now she's Lauren Swicker. It's a girl. Have you been to Australia? No, and no. we want to go so bad. We, we want to go so We had a long bad. list of countries to visit pre-2020 and they got postponed and now we're popping out a little baby. So, yep. But we plan to, to travel often with said child. So, um, yeah, we're going to travel a lot. <laughs> we say that now. We say that now. We're going to do it. All the we're parents, all the parents are like, okay. No, we're doing talk it. Talk to me in six months. Was, um, was, was she, she planned? planned or a happy surprise? Both. Yeah, we, both. we got into the seat. We, we entered the season of our marriage where we were just kind of like, this would not be a bad time. So we stopped 
not trying. <laughs> and then, uh, and then it was a surprise. <laughs> and uh, and so yeah, we're we're just we feel blessed beyond belief, and and um, and we're just we're still praying. If 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 you're a praying person, keep 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 baby yeah. in your prayers. Um, just that everything goes well. Yes. And, um, keep we're looking. Baby's we're looking. Healthy. You know. Have, you, have you said the due date? No, I haven't said the due date. Well, but we're not going to say the due date, but we're like, we're like a little over a month close. out. We're pretty close. No, we're, yeah, we're like right at a, like a month -ish. We'll let you know. We'll let you know. Um, oh, questions. I'm Is it a boy or girl? It's a girl. How excited are you to be a girl dad? I'm so excited. He's going to be the cutest I have, girl dad. I have dad. three sisters, so I am, I am primed and ready, and um, I, I can't tell you how how stoked I am to watch all the shows and braid all the hair and do all the face masks. He can braid hair better than me, you guys. I don't know if that's true. It's true. We do. We have We baby's have baby's name. name. We're not talking about it. It's a secret. <laughs> um yeah, so what we do have the name though. And it was it's actually funny. Everyone says like, "Oh, did you did you get a did you get a good name and all this stuff?" And uh if it was a boy, I kind of had a name in mind, and if it was a girl, she was going to pick it, and she said the girl name, and I was like, "I love it." And I told her, I was like, well, if it's a boy, I want this. And she goes, love it. Yeah. And we literally haven't changed or, you know, and we're open to if we look at it and we go, oh, she is definitely <laughs> a, well, if we look at her and she's definitely, you know, whatever, we'll change it. But, but right now, no, it, it, um, very easy and, uh, we're, we're super excited. Yes. Thank you guys so much. These are really sweet comments and it means the world to us. You guys are so. Indonesia. Josh, are you nervous? Beyond. Beyond nervous, but I'm ready. I'm nervous and ready, uh, as ready as you can be. I should say. Um, yeah, we're very, very excited. Um, shoot, I'm sorry. <laughs> so many it. cool questions. Um, Everyone's asking us to tell us, tell you guys the name. What have post? you guys acted in other movies? This girl is a movie. Feet. What's the word I'm looking for? I don't know. She's been in lots of movies. I have not. I've only been in movies with her. <laughs> <laughs> you TV uh, shows without me. I've been, yeah. But feature films, if you've seen a Lifetime movie, you've probably watched her. The My, titles are the best. Yeah, the titles are always fun with Lifetime. But my favorite one was the um, Twisted Twin movie. Is it called Twisted Twin still? I think so. Something like that. The one where I played a twin on Lifetime. She played two different Twisted girls, like the nice one and the evil one. That was fun because yeah. I totally know both of them. It was so fun. To Just do kidding. You guys. It was my favorite. Okay. Aside from Kelly Christmas and Roped. Yes. Yeah, we met on a movie called Roped. Um, Have you seen Derricka recently? Yes. She's one of my best friends. Um. Yeah, D sweet. You're going to eat this? I think I need to microwave it again. Josh has been doing all the cooking for us. I have. Um, because I've been working so much, and he just discovered the Instapot. Yeah, it saves so much time. He made chicken and vegetables tonight, and it's almost 9 p.m., and I'm just now eating. Oh, no. <laughs> um. And Safe Haven, oh, my gosh. So Safe Haven, um, I was actually. Oh, somebody totally looked you up. I know. I was In Safe Haven, I was actually. Um, Jay Huff's stand-in. Um, that's when I was working in... Jay Huff? Yeah. I like that. Ju I just don't know. Julian Huff. Julian? Oh. Julian? Julian. Julian. I was her stand-in um, for, for the movie, and they gave me a cute little part. I had to hand her... I was like a barista in the movie, so that was fun. It was really fun. Someone said, tell us your uh, a little bit of your love story. And we we met during a chemistry read for Roped. Uh, yeah. It's on Netflix. Um, and uh, we filmed the movie, and that's how we kind of hit it off. And a couple months after the movie, we started dating. And we dated for about 11 months. And I popped the question. And about seven months later, we got, we got married. It was yeah. quick. It was so fast. It was quick. Oh, my gosh. Cravings. Okay, guys, the weirdest thing <laughs> that I have wanted in this pregnancy was it was in my first trimester, so the first three months, 
I wanted squeezed limes in a in a glass. So I would literally take a lime, cut it, and squeeze it into a glass. And that's all I wanted was squeezed limes. And then, and then I would buy what she wanted, what she was craving in bulk. And then yeah. the second I would just stock the fridge head to toe with it, she would then change her craving. I wouldn't want it anymore. And, I, and it would be something I didn't like. I'm like, oh, jeez. <laughs> I've got 12 limeades. And then I wanted corn, canned corn, and, and a plum. And I ate that at the same time. Very strange. Yeah. Saludos desde Mexico. What's up, Mexico? <laughs> I just read a comment where somebody has the same craving. That might mean that you're having a girl. If you crave citrus at the beginning of your pregnancy, that might mean that you're having a girl. That's what a lot of people say. We have two pet, uh, two pets. Two and a half if you count me, because sometimes I can act like a... Like a pet? Like a pet. That's weird. Never mind. Two pets. Two dogs. <laughs> um, two little, furry, rather useless, Papa, but cuddly dogs. Papa and Mina. Papa and Mina. They're Papageno and Femina. We fight about this one topic. He thinks... We don't fight. We just we, have differing opinions. No, we don't fight. I think small dogs are cuddly. But that's he, about it. He loves them. And the dogs yeah. love you. Nah. Yeah. He wants a big dog. I want a big dog. I want I want like a Roddy or a, a Bull Mastiff. Something How many like kids would we, would we like to have? I always joke and say I want a lot. The, the serious I'm answer like, okay. is it's, it's, <laughs> it's her body. It's her decision. Um, if, it, if it were for some reason my decision, I would, I would probably land around three. I like that number. I think three is a good number. You can you can um, fit them all in a car. You know, we yeah. don't we wouldn't have to get a bigger car yeah. to fit our kids. We'll look at more. Questions. Um, what can you tell us about GH? Mean. Nothing. I can't. Uh, Mean-a I, I can't talk about it. I get in trouble when I talk about GH storyline. Oh no! Do you Do guys we snowboard? snowboard? We ski. We ski. Fun I, fact: I also that is, know how to snowboard, but I like skiing the best. I don't know how to snowboard. I I tried it once because I love Johnny Tsunami. Sorry, I have to um, brush my hair, you guys. If I don't brush my hair while it's wet, it dries. <laughs> um, but um, what was I going to say? Skiing. That that was one of the things when I was like ten years old or twelve years old, and I think about my future wife. I was like, oh, she's going to be a really good skier because I love skiing growing up. And, um, and, and, and then when we were talking during filming, uh, when we first met, she said something about how she was obsessed with skiing. And I was like, oh, yeah. Oh no. And then one of our and first then, things that we did together. And then, and then I'm like, oh, you ski. That's so cute. Like thinking I'm so good at skiing. And, and she's like, yeah, I used to go sometimes. And, and then she, I was like, let's go skiing together. And I think that this is where I'm going to impress her. Like be like the man that teaches or something, you know? And, uh, and we go skiing in the very first run. She's like 10 times better than me. And I was so, so sad because I, that was my moment to like kind of show her what was going on. You know, I, I'm a skier and she just destroyed me. So she's 10 times the skier I am. Um, it's a hundred percent. No, 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 no. It's a hundred percent true. Oh my God. Um, but, uh, but yeah, so that's our fun story with, story with skiing. But we love it. We want our kids to do it at super young age. That's my, my happy place is skiing. Yep. That's where I proposed to her on, at Beaver he Creek. He did. A lot of you probably know, but um, he proposed to me during a game of charades. Also, our friend Danny. No, I'm not going to cornhole. You're better, dude. If he's going to cornhole. Did you have to get a place when you found out you were pregnant or did you have the space? We do have we this have space, space, thankfully. We don't. We no longer have a guest bedroom, so yeah, sorry. Yeah, we don't have a guest bedroom. Sorry, anymore, mom and dads. But um, we have a baby room. Moms and dads. Great. Uh, but yeah, so uh, now guests will they have a pullout couch? Yeah, it's um, quite comfortable. I was just in Beaver. Oh, God, go oh. skiing with all y'all. Beaver Creek. That's that would be fun if we ever did kind of build some yes, kind of he like. Yes, loves kombucha, but this is cayenne flavored, and it scares me. It's go it's on. good for you. <laughs> No, to do like a group, like some kind of like group trip. That would be really fun. Like get a bunch of people and go skiing. I think that'd be really fun. One of my dreams is to build some sort of platform. Lauren and I haven't really discussed this 
publicly yet, but if we were going to do um, some sort of a YouTube or social media that we took, you know, took seriously. And then um, I grew up, I'm a pastor's kid, and I grew up going to Guatemala every year, and we worked with a really cool um, um, organization down there. And I think it'd be so fun to grab some of you guys, like whoever whoever wants to do it, and we get a big group of people and, and, and go somewhere and do some good and, and it'd be so much fun. Turn off our phones. And yeah, I think it'd be rad. So, uh, I don't know. C- keep that percolating in the yes, back of your on head. YouTube. I think we should maybe do that. We should try it. it might be I have, really my bad only, first. my only hard thing with YouTube is like, <laughs> I, I genuinely don't think my life or our life is interesting enough for people to like want to tune in. Um, and I'd, I'd have to get good at the, the like, like and subscribe um, part. Oh, yeah. <laughs> but, but we do, we do want to, we, we, we think about it and we think, it, we think that it would be fun. So, um, so yeah, let us, let us know if it's something that you guys would watch. I could give you day in the life and Lauren could be passed out of sleep and I could start and I could be like, I would be so Good mad. Morning. And no. do, do wonderful camera angles. Hmm. Let's see. The Swickered PKs. We're almost there. We almost have. All right. We'll get out of your guys' hair. Everybody can go to bed. Hold on. We'll do. What's your comb? <laughs> What's your... I told Some you nasty you. pink brush. <laughs> <laughs> it is kind of gross you now. Don't, don't show it. It's, I have to brush my hair when it's wet or else it looks real weird when I wake up in the morning. I have to nah, I... brushing it until it's dry. I have been to Costa Rica. It's my one of my favorite countries I've ever been to. I would love to move there. That yeah, that would be a country that once we're like sick of Los Angeles, I'd probably just find a little house in Costa Rica. Do you and call pluck each day. other's eyebrows? Absolutely. Lauren plucks mine. I pluck his. Eyebrows. She doesn't let me pluck hers. Yes, it's a wet brush. I don't, I don't even know what that show, means. I don't want to show it now because there's tons of hair stuck in it. I'm I'm not bald. I probably James. Uh, do you <laughs> James that was from James <laughs> um watching from Alberta Canada right on cool. in. hey this is awesome um how have you been, been to, to Texas, Texas? <sighs> we always we just talk I, about it I love but Texas. we haven't been in a while I feel we so bad there. for what's happening there mm-hmm. if any of you are in Texas I hope I think I hope everything's okay yeah but it was that was we were praying. New York. Hard. Right on. Our friend Brian's asking about our Myself. garden. We have a tiny little garden. Oh, it's and not tiny. We've I've got strawberries. <laughs> we I ate a strawberry from our garden today and it was delicious. Strawberries, broccoli, lettuce, all the peppers, jalapenos and <laughs> That is so gross. Shh. She's Shh. pulling the hair out of the brush. I'm <laughs> so upset. It's not, no, I'm not. All right, everyone have a wonderful night. We're going to start doing this more. <laughs> We're going to get better at We're it. We're going to get better at it. We're going to have content. <laughs> We're going to have, what content are we going to have? I don't know. We're going to have good Ugh. content. We're going to plan for these. We're going to plan a topic. Who's the, who would you say is the funniest co-star on GH? Chad. Chad is I a love Chad. jokester. He's a good guy. Okay. Um... All right. All love. I hope everyone has a wonderful night. Thank you for checking in. Hope we got to answer some uh, some questions you yeah. had. And, uh, and Rapid fire. We'll do like two more questions. Okay, hold on. Uh, um, do you share the same religion? Yes. yes. We are, are, both, are both Christians. And skincare routine. That's fun. I could do it. Uh, I could do my skincare. That's what they're interested I'm, in. Is. I say sim- the simpler. The... That wasn't correct. Simple is better with skincare. Besides um, Spanish, what languages you would like to learn? Ooh. I want to say I would love to learn French. Um, How'd that but go? But it's really hard. We tried. <laughs> we tried. I, in college, I took uh, Mandarin for a while. And I was... I actually loved it. It was the only class I got an A in. Um, I've lost 99% of it. Um, all right. We're done. Oh I'm sorry. So many. You don't want to sit here and stare at us. I love yes. you guys. Thank you. Have a good night. Love you guys. Um,
Talk to you soon. So soon. We'll talk about all the face cares and wet brushes, dry brushes. <laughs> The wet brush the is like things. ten. It's like five dollars or something at CBS. It's my favorite. She went to school of journalism. I majored in accounting, and we both quit to be try to be actors. All <laughs> On right. that note, bye. Bye, everyone. <laughs> Hold on.